So hello all LEGO fans, this is me Mario, and today I'm doing a set review of Spider-Man, my boy Ultimate Bridge Battle. You know what I'm doing this in my hotel room, because I'm leaving today, so I want to throw, throw away the box. So here it is, and yeah. So I'll do the rest of the, I'll show the rest of the review and the whole build when I get home. So I'm back home, and here is the Web Warriors Bridge Battle, and... It's pretty cool, a lot of features, and like a good decent amount of like figs. It has like a lot of mega figures, and now, um, I'll first show you the mega figs. So, here are the um good guys you get. Um, so you get four good guys, and you get the same old Spider Man from 2012 or 13, I think 13, and Alt May, which is um a new character, but was existing Lego parts. But I don't know. I think the face is new. I don't know. And yeah, it's pretty cool. So if you take off the her head, you can show her she's scared, which I think she should be in the set. And then you get yeah Spider Man. So for spy, so you get these two spiders. Um and. Yeah, here's Spider-Man. You get the same back printing, but no dual mold legs. And same uh, row piece, as always. And here's this white piece here. You can put, like, it allows a stud. Make your figure here and connect without, like, putting it on top of the hand. So it's, so it's not, it's not you know, on top method. And same thing here. So you just take this off and... So you can put it back to here like this. And you put it back like that. Which is pretty cool. And then you get uh, her. She's a new uh, character. And exclusive. these two are exclusive. But also not me. Only person not exclusive is probably Spider-Man. And you can take off her hair. Like, I mean, her hair. And here's the printing on the back. Um, so from the show, she like she's like kind of she's accurate, but her hair, how they make her hair and her face is not accurate because the same face as Scarlet Spider. So, and all I really is the hair on top of it, which is kind of not accurate. And she has these cool white gloves, I think, but it's not accurate either. Here's Scarlet Spider, which is totally accurate to the show. I like his printing on his arm, which is cool. And has a, he has this row piece. You can switch out the, these pieces. Like this, you get two row pieces. You get two of these um, webby pieces. And yeah. Here's what he looks like on the back. And it shows him. Uh, um, like. Yeah, like, yeah, this is it, like, hood. And here's the double, this has a little double-sided face. And here's what it looks like in the front. No printing for the legs, which is disappointing. Has a spider logo here and a belt. And it's pretty cool. And now I'm going to show you the villains. So here are your main vil three villains. Goblin. Goblin, uh, Craven the Hunter, and Scorpion. So, um, I should note this base plate does not come in the set at all. So he's to hold the mega figs. And for Green Goblin, he has dual mole legs, which is awesome. And pretty on arms, which is double awesome. And he's just cool exclusive to the set. Um, pumpkin, which is flaming uh thing on his head. On the um head thing, which is cool. I guess a uh, thing like face, like I'm um, home, like helmet or something or hat. His ears, like his ears, and yeah. Then you get this like um purple thing which you can take off. And here's his face, which is weird, angry face, like ah! and like like <laughs> like mischievous face which is cool and 
get printing on his legs and printing here, which is cool. It looks like the old fashioned gob instead of the newer one. Like, it looks kind of weird. Like, I know. It was that the, like helmet looks like kind of like he's like a mutant or something. You know. So, this thing. And, yeah, it's pretty cool. Then we have Scorpion. Which is. He has this cool exclusive piece for now. So the roll of $10 it was this piece. And the scorpion, multiple side, um, um, like, fa like, actually has, um, dual sided, uh, face, but 